Hello, America, and welcome to What? Your favorite alternative music TV program. I'm Chris Strouth, and I'd like to welcome you to this, the 10th edition of What? Tonight we have a real special show for you, one I think you're really going to enjoy. One of my personal favorites, the absolute masters of rockabilly. Nay, nay, not the masters, the champs. Why, yes, I'm referring to the Viro Champs, a band I think you will enjoy quite a bit. One, two, three, four, one. session about to begin. So we're sitting here and we're talking with 
the Vibro Champs. And I'm feeling particularly shmarry today. So, uh, Vibro Champs, why the name? Dave. <laughs> Amplifier. Amplifier, old Fender Amplifier from the early 60s. They had champs for a long time, which were little tweed amps, and they turned into, when vibrato was the, the cool thing, they had the vibro champs, which is uh, an amplifier and not a sexual term. Good, Dave. Well, what made you guys want to have a uh, rockabilly band in, uh, in this day and age? Kind of, uh, kind of not necessarily in, the, in a time of uh, an enormous rockabilly scene, especially but it in is. Minneapolis. Well, not in Minneapolis. Minneapolis is way behind. We're a black hole in the rockabilly uh, universe. That's a matter of fact, that's the right reason why we started in Minneapolis, because Minneapolis is like a good two years behind right now. Uh, New York and uh, um, well, the East Coast and the West Coast have huge rockabilly scenes. Chicago has and, a uh, yeah, Chicago, scene. which is 500 miles away from us, has a big rockabilly scene. Then you have, uh, um, you have a lot of rockabilly coming from out of town here. Um, the Reverend Hart and Heat, uh, Southern Culture on the Skids, uh, Flat Dual Jets. Um, Some people remember the Stray Cats, they're still around. Yeah, Stray Cats played right for Sturgis last year. Um, let's see, Evan Johns used to play a lot, but he doesn't seem to get into town very much. And the audiences we've been playing for have really liked it. And Sleepy LaBee. Yeah. It's coming all the time. So we got a lot of rockabilly coming through here, we just don't have a per said set scene yet, which it's not really I'm trying to make a mailing list and change that. It's not really talked up a lot, is it? Good morning, Captain. Good morning to you.
few more shovels full of dirt, my life will soon be over. Hear that little old girl of mine, I moved to the land of Clover. I'm digging a hole to bury my heart, because my baby, we had to part. Part out here. This is great because I don't actually have to do anything now. Mm -hmm. Wind you guys up, go. <laughs> and start us bickering and we're off. <laughs> hey, ask us if we're playing anywhere soon. You know, funny, I was going to get around to that. Uh, are you guys playing around soon? I know that uh, basically at any given time, at any almost any given bar in America, and we can see you guys playing. Yeah, but where in particular coming up? Uh, we're playing lacrosse the weekend after uh, Thanksgiving. No, at, say it isn't at so. At Dave's Rock and Blue Saloon. No. And... We are playing with Dick Dale. No, it's not D I S C O L P. It's Dick Dale, king of surf guitar at the Caboose at the fabulous West Bank, and uh, everybody should be there because he is the king of surf guitar. Of course, that's ancient history now. No, the new album is making him oh. relive his. That's true. His I'm prominent saying, days. Saying. And we are, we are playing over by Bill over there. Look, isn't it amazing? Yet another poster sponsoring you guys. Yeah, at the spe with the Spectres at the Blues Saloon. And this is a very rare occasion here because they usually don't have bands like us at the Blues Saloon. Except they did have Paladins and Forbidden Pigs and such like that. But That was such a fun show. Yes. Is that your natural hair color? You know, um, it's funny you should mention that. Uh, it is. It's. Uh, it's weird. No, I actually. Uh, I'm under contract now. That. Uh, that. Uh, it's. It's got to be uh, kind of with the seasons. Oh, it has to match the. Uh, the decor. Well, you know, it's funny, but I don't know why I come here. But there is something that I kind of like. You know. Feel so, more at home with. So did, did your hair go the color first? See, this first? is supposed to be an. We'll be right back after these important yet exciting messages. <clears throat> oh, Chris, uh, you, yeah. you forgot our plug. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. The VibroChamps Sustone 45 plug. The VibroChamps have a 45 RPM release coming out with Besame Mucho and Magic 8-Ball. Sorry about that. Please buy the record. And we'll be right back after these exciting messages. <laughs> Now pay attention because this is going to go quickly. Take a standard $1 bill, look up in the upper left-hand corner on the right-hand corner of the dollar bill. You'll see a very small owl there, an owl. What is that owl watching? Who is it looking at? Then on the back here, you'll notice the Eye of Horus, an ancient Egyptian symbol, which is actually the seal of the United States government. Novus Ordo Seclorum is what it says beneath that seal. New World Order. Coincidence? I think not. Buenas noches. Y bienvenidos al televisión en vivo. Nosotros los Vibro Champs. Y ahora, una canción de romancia, de amor, muy fina de los años 40, que se llama Besame Mucho. Uno, dos, uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Pachacha, boom. Besame, besame mucho. So my dear, I hear music divine. So besame, besame mucho. Well, I love you forever if you just love me tonight. Whoa, dearest one, if you should leave me, each little dream would take away and my life would be. Well, 
Stop it. <laughs> what's the one? What's the one where Gene Vincent? Gene Vincent was, uh, Girl Can't Help It. Girl Can't Help It. Oh, I love it. Well, that is... Ah, there you go. Got one. Girl Can't Help It. It's the big one. Have, actually, have you ever seen, uh, <laughs> the, uh, uh, Will Success Spoil Rock Hunter? Yeah, that is good. That, would, that's, that's uh, uh, that is my Dan favorite film. I thought it was pretentious. Well, you're a jerk. <laughs> do you know who Johnny Legend is? Uh, Does he care? No, I do not know who Mr. Legend is. He's a great movie star. You should know. What would you uh, What would you suggest that uh, that this viewer buy is like a, is a quintessential uh, rockabilly record? Um, Channel eighty three. No, new or old? Well. R45. What did you get right now? You have a you have a 45 out. Yes. And what uh, what label would that be on? That is on Sustone. That would be a Sustone record. Sustone. Ah. Ah. Don't forget that S. A lot of people do. And as far as like other music, you'll you want to buy uh, Southern what, Culture. What single would be? Uh, what no. what single? Channel. Uh, and, no, it's it Sustones, be, uh, and it's Bass Ame Mucho with Magic Eight Ball. Ooh, ex great songs. Exciting, exciting, uh -huh. love and adventure. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and some stuff on Channel 83 is really good, you say? Um, Channel 83 is where our new uh, CD is going to be released as soon as we get into the studio and get the rest of it done. And that's on the subsidiary label, which is Sci-Fi Western, which would be the Rockabilly label of Channel 83. Hey, that's exciting. And that about wraps it up for... Uh, for our fun hip hoppy little interview time here. Wow. You think we can use any of this? I think so. <laughs> I think there's quite a bit. I'm hungry. We gotta get something to eat. Just say your name, and then I'll say my name, then I'll say at the end of the Viber Chance. Hey, that's that really good. Okay, go, 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 go. My name is Paul Westerberg, <laughs> and you are watching Channel 33. St. Paul Community Television. My name is David, and we're with the Viber Champs. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Westerberg, you fuck. <laughs> that's good. That's a keeper. <laughs> Paul Westerberg, you fuck. <laughs> Shabba Lava. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Without Louisiana. Without Shabba Lava Lava.
quita, quita, mira. Thanks for joining us on this, the 10th edition of What. I'd like to give a special thanks to our band, The Vibro Champs, one of my personal favorites. And until next time, same bad time, same bad channel, we'll see you soon. Yeah.